stereotype-busting mayor of Reno, Hillary Sheedy. Thank you so much for being here. This truly means a lot. Today, it is my honor to announce that an exciting e-commerce company called Zazzle will now open core distribution and manufacturing right here in Reno. Zazzle works with Fortune 500 companies such as Disney and Warner Brothers, just to name a few. They are bringing 250 jobs to the biggest little city. So far, we've invested $378,000 of blight fund to address a broad range of issues from graffiti to condemned buildings to trash along the river. The biggest little city deserves these big improvements. One of our crowning achievements in 2016 was the transformation of the city's most recognizable eyesore, a blighted building that sat vacant for 30 years, and you all know it, formerly known as the King's Inn. Today, it is home to the hip Third Street Flats, where millennials and tech meet. Our homeless population needs more than money to change their lives. They need opportunity like the Reno Works program that recruits individuals residing in our homeless shelters to provide life skills and education, full-time employment assistance, and intense case management support. The city of Reno has allocated $160,000 to this program over the last two years. Next month, we will celebrate our fifth Reno Works graduating class. I'm extremely excited to say the same story of transformation is now in the early stages for Park Lane, Midtown's neighbor. Soon the site will no longer be home to asphalt, seagulls, and fences. After 20 years of sitting vacant, Park Lane will blossom into a vibrant mixed-use project featuring shops, restaurants, and housing. I encourage you all to get on board as we take our city to new heights in 2017. And remember, please be kind. The sky's the limit, Reno. God bless.